Pretty good. It's always hard to weld a uh, reversing valve because when they've been already, uh, you know, welding the used pipe. Wrapping it tight right at the base right there is pretty really important. The paper is pretty much dry now, and it was soaking wet when I uh, wrapped this valve. Now we just need to put in the Schrader core and pressure test with nitrogen. You know, sometimes I just can't help it, but I gotta take a few minutes and bask in the glory that is my brazing skills. I don't know, but sometimes I think I leave it looking better than it left from the factory. <laughs> Especially if it's a good man. <laughs> This one looks better than what it was when I got to that old one. Fuck yeah. Some people swear by turbo torches, but nothing beats the power.
done in a snap with the acetylene oxygen torch. Now I've got it filled up with nitrogen, watching it on the gauge, which is anything hooked up, everything else is sealed up. And the pressure switch on as well, because the other one was uh, falling apart. Well, start the vacuum. Evacuate it down the unit before I'll recharge it. And now I'll finish hooking up my reverse and valve coil. Well, it's complete, but I didn't record myself charging it or anything because I got caught in the rain and it rained like a mother on me. I had panels open, I had to go close up and everything. So, up and running. EMS checkout is good. All the systems I worked on are up and running. The store is all at temperature. Called another day. Still sprinkling and starting to get ready to jump on my ass. Arizona don't get that much rain, but got ready to drive home in Friday night traffic. Yay. What the bloody hell? was that.